Hey everybody, just thought I'd share with you a new Sebenza 25. This one is not my knife, it is uh, ESP Matt's ESPMET, but he's let me do a little video on it here just to share with you guys that are so nice as to subscribe to my channel. Uh, I guess what I ought to do is bring out the Um Nums in my pocket to give you guys a size comparison. This is a large 25, which you'll notice is that the handle material and the blade stock are the same width. Length of the knife is about the same dimension. On them and being just a hair longer in the handle. And the blades are very similar in length. This one has the best detent I've ever felt on a Chris Reeve knife. And you can see on the lock bar how it falls in. It's excellent, excellent. You know, some of the differences in the knife that we went over at the blade show are the jimping. The hump under the spine, the divot in front of the jimping, standard double thumb logs, hey buddy. The choil in the handle, the extra, and then it's overall thinner in dimension this way because they removed it from the normal stack, which would have been at that height. Otherwise, different screws, different pivot. It's using a ball bearing or ceramic ball bearing interface, which you can see right there which is larger than the Umnum Zan. I believe it's an eighth inch ball. The new pivot that was on the tie lock for years and is now on the Umnum Zan. Let me try to turn this flash off. Different setup for the stop pin, which is milled and looks nicer. And a concave backspacer that doubles as a lanyard holder. No hole for the lanyard and no locating hole for the machining. I was waiting for my buddy to bring this one over to decide whether I was going to get one or not. I was feeling the fever. Wanted it pretty bad, but at the same time I just was trying to hold off. If they're all as good as this one, I'm going to have more than one. Feels great in the hand. No flaws. Let me cut a little piece of paper up with the thing and the new grind that they're using that he's calling, what, high hollow? Yep. It, it's the same stock as my Umnum Zan, which is factory sharp, and I cut the same piece of paper side by side, and this thing was cutting like it was a razor blade in comparison to my very sharp Umnum Zan. Very nice knife. Figured I'd share with you guys real quick while he let me. I am definitely going to be getting one. It may replace the Umnum Zan in my pocket. That's how much I like it. I may be monotone and talking and boring, but you guys got to know that's a fine knife. And I like it even better than my Star Attack, which is no slouch. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. And subscribe to Espmet if you haven't. That's his knife there. That'd be mine. I did a. We had four of these on the table today. <laughs> my three and his Star Attack. I should have done a video on that, but you guys have seen enough of that stuff lately, I guess. Thanks for watching and subscribe to Espmet. E S P M E T. I'll have him in the tags.